the, 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 the discussion, the news, the information. Also, we'll train you, and apart from training, we will mentor you. Mm-hmm. Apart from mentoring, your mentorship in itself is not just about grooming your career. It's basically about managing that career. Mm-hmm. So, like when you ask me the other time, what would, how would a mentee get a mentor? Mm-hmm. An institute like. Liberal Arts Music Institute already have connections with industry groups, male, female, local, and international that they can connect you with. Once they know what you want, the local sites they know, they will now be able to help you midwife your career to the landline. You understand? That way, you are good, you are giving all the armory to go on. You now have the support of the institute with whoever the mentors are, one or two, as they as you require, as your as your talent requires to take you there. So even while you are in the industry, because let me tell you one thing, it's easier to gain stardom than to maintain it. You understand? To maintain currency. An institute like that will keep working on you, will keep managing your career. So that you will never be stale. There are some industry practitioners that have been there for one decade, two decades, three decades, four decades, and they're still there, and they never lose their currency. You know why? Because they keep reinventing themselves, and that is what an institute like Liberal Arts and Music Institute can do. So basically, it's like brand management. Yes. You understand? Aha. It's, they, they become brands, and they now get marketed. They get managed to the point of being relevant. Mm-hmm. You know, acting was just acting. Mm-hmm. You understand? But now, this is not just acting for acting. People now do um, brand reinforcement to the point of endorsing other brands. Mm-hmm. And it is your manager, it is your mentor who can help to groom you from being what you are to actually, you know, upgrading your, and, and, uh, your, 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 your brand to the point of being able to endorse other brands then your brand becomes a master brand. It's not just a brand. Thank you so much, sir. I believe our viewers at home have learned so much things today. You've learned so much things today from our mentor, our father, our producer, and our director. But one more question, sir, and that is, what advice would you give to anyone out there who is aspiring to become great in this industry? Well, like any other industry, aspiration is not just about, it's not that, it's not all you need. It's not just about aspiring to be somebody. It's not just about aspiration. It's about desperation. You have to be desperate to be your best. I mean, desperate is not just about just rushing or fighting to be no 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 i'm talking about you being desperate within yourself to achieve your set goals and being desperate enough being determined enough that's the word being determined enough to stay there stay focused and keep achieving your best and your best isn't good enough you just need to keep being great 
and continue reinventing yourself like I said earlier and keep continuing to challenge yourself to be greater than even the greatest thing. Because there ain't stopping for an artist. There is no retirement for an artist. Even when he's in formal service and he's retired, he's not tired. Yes. He keeps working. That is why you still see people in their 90s who are cinematographers, still doing documentaries, still shooting and all that. In other professions, they will have retired at 60, 65, 70 at most. But an artist, even at 70, has just started. He's still a baby. And he'll still be going for master classes to train and retrain. Because in theatre, we'll learn. We unlearn and then we relearn. And we keep going through that cycle all the time. And so it's not over until it's over. That's when you're dead. <laughs> when the curtain draws. Thank you so much. Thanks for the time. Thank you, for having me. Thank you so much. We really Thank appreciate you. your time. We appreciate everything you said to us today. And I believe our viewers out there are picked one thing or the other and have learned one thing. Remember, aspiration is not enough. You have to be desperate. You have to be determined. You have to you have to build that potential, that inherent potential and skills in you. You have to develop that talent. Remember, it's a raw material that has to go through the process of refinement. So for you to become a better person, as our guest said this afternoon, he said you have to learn, you have to learn, and you have to learn. So you have to learning to become a better person. So thank you so much for staying tuned with us at this program. Thank you so much. You can always tune in on Lamp TV for more interesting episodes. Thank you. So we'll see you next time. Bye. Yesterday may not solve the problem of today. Join us on the discussion on